Now the Montana State football team couldn't rebound off the bye week as they hoped and falling to North Dakota 16 to 12 on Saturday. It was a rough game offensively for the Bobcats who didn't score their first touchdown until this moment. Troy Anderson punched one in on the goal line in the middle of the fourth quarter. On third down, Montana State was 8 of 18 against the Fighting Hawks. But today at his weekly press conference, there were no excuses for MSU head coach Jeff Cho. Second half, I just, I just think there were so many things that we could have done better, starting with me as the head coach in terms of uh, getting us into better play selection, utilizing timeouts to get us into out of bad play selection. I'm the head football coach. When, when things don't go well, that's on me as the head football coach. Everybody's going to share some level of, of responsibility, but I bear the ultimate responsibility, and, and I accept that responsibility, and I'm fine with that. And uh, for us to improve, we got to be better in a number of areas. The Bobcats have dropped their second consecutive game. The last time that happened was nearly a year ago to the day when they lost to Weber State and Idaho State.